guys, it's Kobe here for another short video on how to um, use your keyboard with GarageBand. So when you type the, note, uh, the keys on your keyboard, it registers in GarageBand as a note um, and you can use it as part of your song. So what you're going to need is a keyboard, in my case the Casio CTK471 and it has to be compatible with MIDI. If it doesn't say um, if it's uh, compatible with MIDI or not, the way you know is if you see these two cables, these two slots for cables. This is a MIDI in and MIDI out. That's really what you need for doing this. The next thing I'm going to need is an Apple computer. Of course, to run GarageBand. And the third thing um, is a USB to MIDI interface. So. See, this is USB. There's the MIDI cables. So, let's start. So, um, what you're going to do is you're going to take your USB to MIDI interface and take the MIDI end, uh, the USB end actually, and plug it anywhere into your USB uh, right here. So, I'm just going to plug it into my hub. Okay, now it's connected. It should show a red light um, if you're using this company, the most popular brand actually. But um, it should show up that you're using USB. Now, um, Power Up Garage Brand. Let's go ahead and click on that. And. Anything? Okay, comes up, uh, go to preferences, go to audio slash MIDI, and it should say one MIDI inputs detected. So that means it's working, and we're uh, on to the second step. Take your uh, USB, I mean your MIDI cables, the in and out, and put them in the place where they uh, go that's marked in the back of your keyboard. Turn on your keyboard, go ahead and um, just to help you, you're going to want to go to window and press keyboard or you can just click command K, but um, when you press, push a note on your, or push a key on your uh, keyboard, you should uh, see it registering as the uh, digital keyboard. So you see when I type that, that uh, when I put that note in, it came up registered right here. So I'm going to do that one more time. So uh, that's how you do it. Let's go ahead and record. Play it back. So you see? Um, it uh, registered as a MIDI instrument and GarageBand was able to read it perfectly fine and now we can um, edit those notes. Thanks for watching. Uh, this was Applicate Tech.